Alrighty, so uh, I think it's pretty clear, but the plan is simple. We're going to ult rush on Escanor. We have a taunt on the team. I accidentally backed out. We have a taunt on the team. And I'm using Margaret not only for her damage increase, but she puts two different buffs on that aren't basic stats. So I'm hoping maybe that will help Griamore do more damage, considering his passive increases dam or his uh, defense per buff. So I'm thinking perfect scenario. We can get his ultimate kind of early, stack him full of buffs, bash on him, <laughs> you know? So I somehow I have 310. I'm still in Challenger, so probably going to be some bots, uh, but just just testing purposes. Honestly, I, I really, really doubt I'm going to use this character um, when it comes to actual gameplay. Like, I, I just, he's, he's kind of just like more of like a meme kind of unit, not really something I would use on like a regular basis or anything. So, yeah. But either way, it's still cool. He's a very cool unit. So... Um, this only lasts, okay, this actually lasts for two turns, which is perfect, because I can probably, he put on a Dissolve as well, so I'm probably going to have to use it this turn. Alright, kind of weird that you'd rank up afterwards. Um, so let's go for, let's go for both buffs at the moment. Let's maybe, I don't know, we can ult rush with Deanne as well she's doing fine she she's fine she's doing fine it's okay Escanor probably will hit her pretty hard this turn but um, we're gonna we're gonna ult we're gonna hit somebody uh, probably Escanor since he's gonna have full ultimate move gauge and then we're gonna slap him with the ult well I don't know I think my my buff is gonna run out this turn oh never mind she's <laughs> she's dead either way uh, ooh, will this kill Griamore it will okay well <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is why I'm not really going to be planning on using this unit in a normal scenario. So, uh, hey, look, he left his sword. Uh, either way, uh, I guess uh, <laughs> moving moving on. Alrighty, we have another Escanor. Uh, he does out-CC me, which is uh, kind of a problem. We do have easy ult rush, though. Actually, this is really good, I think, because now... We don't necessarily have to rely on. Oh no! Watch him target. Never mind. I don't think it's even gonna matter because yeah, I was gonna say watch him target him, but it doesn't matter because even the residual damage was gonna kill him there. So, boy oh boy, this is going well. All right, looks like you, everybody's using the same thing, I, I guess. So. I still think this is probably a bot, but he has much higher CC. We do get the the turn one again, but um, my odds are low here. Okay, so just just that is doing so much damage. Oh man. Okay. Um, the best thing about this is that we don't have to really rely on. Uh, Deanne's taunt because we're gonna have evasion for this turn So this might actually be really good. I don't know if we didn't get this hand I think we were pretty much screwed because if we go second and he's already dealing that much damage He didn't even use Escanor last turn um, So I'm actually interested. Well, he's not actually gonna use him. I, I was gonna say uh, I'm interested to see if the the extra damage that the single target does would affect him with the evasion on? I would assume not, but you never know, I guess. Um, so he's got full ultimate move gauge. And, I mean, Ludo's kind of got some ultimate move gauge. I'm more interested to see if he can do some decent damage to Escanor, though. Because Escanor's kind of our biggest threat. So let's try this. We're going to do one on type disadvantage, full ultimate move gauge. Okay, 400k is not not the greatest. Obviously, we're, we're cutting down a lot on uh, having our defense support. So we didn't quite kill Escanor there. I think if he would have had at least one more ultimate move gauge, we probably would have killed him. But uh, <laughs> obviously, uh, he didn't. So we didn't we didn't kill him. So, yeah. But not having Gil Thunder in the back is obviously kind of an issue. Um, you know, we're not... We don't have... Which McCallit? Uh, 
Nalvami on the team or Raftalia, so we're not being able to get like a buff increase or anything. So it's it's kind of a problem. We're gonna go for Deanne's ultimate here on top of card space, basically. So if we can pull any more Grimoire cards, that would be fantastic. Because obviously this is kind of his his showcase. That's uh, okay. Two two six or higher, or two six or three six. So, okay, we did get two Griamore cards, so this is really good. We don't have a Griamore buff, unfortunately, but if we survive with Margaret, we will have the Purify, so that's two more buffs. Plus, we have our ultimate on, so he has really high stats. I'm actually, I want to look at his stats this, this time, because I haven't been looking at his stats, but if you know me, I, I don't really know what good stats look like. I know that that's really high, <laughs> so 93k. Obviously, it could be way higher if we had more defense going, but, um, you know, it is what it is. Um, let's, let's just try to attack these two. Obviously, I, I would like to use the Deanne ult and everything, but we're going to just test his damage and everything because that's kind of the whole point of why we're here. Really close to killing him. 335, not too bad. Um, and then we don't pull any more Grimoire cards. All right, I, I guess I'm just gonna do some ults and get this over with, I guess. We'll uh, we'll move on to the next one and see if, I don't know, if we can somehow do this again. All right, actually, really quickly, um, he killed Margaret off that turn with his Escanor, so I'm gonna buff up. Uh, Ludo has full, so it's gonna be type, type neutral. And then we'll finish off Melee with this. I'm just interested to see how much damage we do because we actually got a buff card. Boom, boom, boom. 675. I mean, it's that's that's really good for Griamore. Like, that's actually insane for Griamore. Um, I mean, it's honestly really good regardless because, I mean, even Deanne's ultimate at 6'6 is only doing that. So, I mean, that's just a one unit. So, I mean, honestly, I'm not too bad. Either way. All right. <laughs> Who could have guessed it? Uh, another Escanor Ludo combo. Um, okay, so we don't have. We do not have the turn one potential here for the evasion, which is really bad for us. Um, so we're basically going to have to taunt here. Ah, uh, crap. We're not going to be able to taunt and get ultimate because he put on the, on the dissolve. Oof. Um. Does this last for three turns? No, it still lasts for two turns. Um, let's purge off. We're going to go for Deanne's ultimate, unfortunately. I really hate to because I want to get Griamores, but he's he's so <laughs> he's so weak. I can't I can't in good conscience try to do that this turn without absolutely getting obliterated because at least this taunt lasts for two turns at level one that's the perfect scenario because that's the biggest reason why uh i wanted to try this because the Nalfami team you know you you rarely ever get stance cards and when you do uh they only last for one turn so that's kind of an issue um honestly i kind of want to use this but at the same time i kind of don't Let's go ahead and use it. I'm, I'm just going to get rid of it, and then we'll... Oh, I'm, I'm dumb. I was supposed to go for Griamore's ultimate. Well, you know what? Uh, sometimes that be happening. All right, well... Maybe we can perfect scenario this. Get rid of Escanor, wait for him to get full ultimate move gauge, and absolutely dunk on him. Who knows? Probably not, but... Uh, I don't know. I've obviously kind of screwed this match up. Let me let me skip forward a little bit, see if I can get something going, and then uh, we'll move on to the last match. All right, never mind. He level three AOE. That's <laughs> that's fantastic. Uh, really, really great stuff. All righty. God, man, can we get something else, please? I just don't want to fight this team anymore. I just. <laughs> It's so... Ah, the meta. The meta has been ruined by the Escanor. Escanor ruined the meta. Everything was the, everything was fine. We had Mono Green. We had Demon Team. We had Goddess Team. We had all this stuff. We had Ragnarok every once in a while. We had, 
it, it was just it was there was diversity it was fantastic you've never seen anything like it before and then all of a sudden boom Escanor everywhere but that's to be expected so um <sighs> We're kind of in that same sort of predicament. Uh, let's get rid of this. I, I really want to push for Deanne's ultimate over Margaret's, but we'll just go ahead and... I mean, we're going to get one of them either way. We just unfortunately can't get Griamores. So... Um, okay, we're, we're in a better spot than we were, so that's good. Um, is Escanor going to kill Deanne is a good question. He is, okay. Now, the next question is... Alright. <laughs> well, you know, at least we got one halfway decent match. I gotta be honest, this is probably the last last thing I'm gonna end up doing with Grimoire. But, um... Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I don't know. There's been a lot of Grimoire content lately. Uh, like, everybody's been pretty much messing with Grimoire. Understandably, he's very, very interesting, but, uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna milk this any more than I have to. I think this is pretty much all I wanted to do with him at the moment, so, uh, unless he just gets some sort of interesting support or something like that in the future, uh, this will probably be the last one for a while. So, either way, uh, that's gonna be it for me. Sorry this wasn't a little bit more eventful. Even, I mean, even with me going up against bots, it was it was going to be a hard sell. Like I mean, Griamor is great once he's built up and everything, but you really need some great circumstances to have him like actually do well and win the game. So yeah, uh, obviously I think the defense defense team is better just because he's going to get more support and deal more damage and everything. But overall, I mean I don't know if you can get, if you can make it work if you get lucky enough, this could be viable, but. Probably not great. Either way, thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe. See you later.